Fear is like an unpredictable sea. At times you can tame it, yet other times. It leads you right into the heart of the storm. Helen, the wife of the King of Sparta, Menelaus, was kidnapped. The princes of Troy, who violated the sacred principle of hospitality, are at fault. The storm they unleashed was soon to sweep through the whole of Greece. With wind in their sails, to the beat of the war drums, the sons of Greece set sail, hungry for justice and glory, ready to restore honor and to punish the bold Trojans. And among them, Achilles, a fearless warrior whose mere presence filled hearts with courage. A hero of a hundred battles. But this time, even he did not believe in an easy victory. The Trojans made sure of that. A fiery blaze illuminated the night sky, bringing death and destruction. Fear looked the Greeks in the eyes. Trapped in the unrelenting grip of the elements, they had to overcome their fright. Suddenly, one of the boats broke free from the hellish turmoil. Achilles, with Myrmidons at his side, fought his way to the shore. If only he could recapture Helen, the war would be at its end. At least that's what he still believed back then. My brothers in arms, we did not fight through the storm and flames to perish in this wretched sun. We have come here to win, and we shall win when we recapture Helen from the enemy's grasp. Many armies have fallen before these walls. Look for their weak points and for battle. That is how we shall try to get inside. Cast away your fear and fight bravely. And when the battle's dust settles, the glory of true heroes shall await you. To Troy! Ah! I need to get to Troy and rescue Helen. The only way to end this war quickly. God, it's him. attract the Trojans' attention. It will give my men time to find a passage inside. I will challenge their commander. And if he is in his right mind, maybe I could convince him to give up Helen. I just need to get to the gate. You must be a fool to come here alone. Is it death you seek, Achilles? Or maybe you want to beg for mercy? Hector, I suggest an honest duel. The victor shall decide Helen's fate and put this war to an end. Helen is under Paris's protection. Are you and a brother ready to sacrifice the lives of your men for her? When the rest of the fleet gets here, 
Hundreds will die on both sides. Why must anyone else die when the commanders can put an end to further bloodshed with one duel? You seek an honorable solution? But there is nothing honorable about war. It's messy and brutal, and history is written by the victors. Archers! On my mark! Prince Hector. History is indeed written by the victors, but your death was not in vain. It will help end this hopeless war. Hopefully this fight bought my men some time. I need to know whether they managed to find entry into the city. God! It's... Sacrifice shall save thousands. After the battle, we will raise our cups in your name. Rest in peace, soldier. Your deeds shall never be forgotten.
Enough of this madness, Paris. Release Helen. Madness? Look beyond the walls. There you will witness true madness. The madness of the kings who came here with you. This war is nothing but the consequences of your mindless decisions. You have stained the honor of the king of Sparta. The honor of the Greeks. Did you think that this insult would go unpunished? You think that if Helen returned to Greece it would change anything? You speak so much of Menelaus, yet you failed to see who wanted this war from the very beginning. Besides, if I handed Helen over to that sick tyrant, it would be like sentencing her to death. I came to love her, and I shall defend her until my last breath. Helen knows the truth. If she returns to that monster, you will kill her. Too many people have died because of her. This war ends right here, right now. I'd rather die than give her up. Before I regained my composure, I was in the clutches of the abyss. Time and space lost meaning, until finally, that voice appeared inside my head. This is not the end, Achilles. Not yet. Find your new path. The line becomes blurrier and blurrier. A smith. Find a smith. <sighs> Is this possible? Am I alive? That voice. A smith. It doesn't make any sense. Where am I? How did I get here? I can't be far from Troy. I need to take a look around. See any Trojans around? Trojans? I don't recall ever stumbling upon them in these lands. And I have lived here for a very long time. I take care of local necropolises and those who rest within them. People used to pay proper respect to the dead. These shrines, too, they sought strength and solace within them to face the challenges ahead. You should try doing that, too. Reflecting upon one's life can bring meaning to one's death. You look tired and lost. Can I help you somehow? Show me the way to the walls of Troy. I must get there as quickly as possible. With the winds on your side, you will have to sail for a couple of days to reach the walls of Troy. Or rather, to what's left of them. Ten years ago, Agamemnon and Menelaus attacked Troy. 
causing fear and bloodshed to spread all over Greece. They arrived here too, in Mycenae. No, that's impossible. You're lying. I am not in the habit of lying to others. I try to help them. Tough times we live in, and mutual aid is now a very precious and rare currency. If I'm not mistaken, somewhere here lives a very skilled smith. He remembers the times of war. I'm certain he will help you find your way in this very difficult moment. He can also take care of your equipment because, as far as I can see, it seems to be past its prime. Thanks for the advice. If you really don't remember the last couple of years, Greece may seem different to you, foreign, and you might not recognize your old friends. Dead rising from the grave? How is that possible? There are more and more of them. Where did they come from? No matter. I shall send them back where they belong. Better at this. As many years. That's insane. Where would I have been for such a long time? Why am I in my scene? I don't have my choice. I need to find that Smith the man was talking about.
Would you look at that? <laughs> Bold of you to show up in Myrmidon armor. I remember skinning the last one of them years ago. <laughs> Seems I was wrong. One more traitor still breathing. <laughs> Seize him, boys, but don't damage his armor. Menelaus will shower us with gold for it. Get the horse out! <laughs> Menelaus' soldiers would not touch a Myrmidon. Traitor? What was that marauder on about? Kill the bastard! Doesn't look good. What happened to you? Bandits. The damn bandits robbed everyone walking down this road. They also got me. There. They have a camp in the bush. You're a warrior. Please, you have to stop them. I will make sure they pay for this. Wild This place looks like a smithy. What happened here? The embers are still smoldering. The fire must have occurred recently. I hope the smith is safe and sound. Maybe I can find him somewhere here. Yo, let's do shots to get here, huh? Lacka. Foolish what abomination! Of get out of there! Or I'll throw a stone at you again! That man will soon fall of the care of this. I need to help him. Thanks be to the gods. I thought that monster would tear me to shreds. Where did you learn how to do this? The soldier does not forget how to fight. I passed by a destroyed forge along the way. Do you know what happened to the smith? Yes, unfortunately I do. My name is Firtas. It so happens that I'm his apprentice. I will tell you everything of how it happened, but I still need your help. What's the matter? I need to retrieve my master's old tools. They should be in those ruins not far from here, but the place, it instills me with fear. By the way, I can see that you could use some new equipment. 
If you bring me these tools, I can teach you a couple tricks of the trade. What do you say? So be it. I shall look for them. You're a lifesaver. We will meet near the smith. But first, I'll make sure there are no maggots around. I think I can see a shrine. This must be the entrance to the ruins Firtus was... Thank <laughs> you. 
Cannot forge that kind of chisel and caliper in all of my cine. Many thanks. If it weren't for you, my master would have surely skinned me alive. Speaking of your master. You see, it seems he was kidnapped. A few weeks ago, some people offered him a job. I didn't like them from the very beginning. There was something sinister in their eyes. They tried to persuade him to take the job, but my master is renowned for his high principles. He refused. So last night they came here and kidnapped him, put a torch to the smithy, and I, I couldn't do anything. Do you know where they could have taken him? They mentioned a camp in the mountains beyond the bridge and the village. I wanted to go and rescue him, but I, I thought it would be better if I looked after his things. It is not safe around here. You are wise to stay here. Do not worry. I shall bring your master back. Thank you, and take care. These people are dangerous.
halt! By the order of Menelaus, the road to Mycenae is closed. Wait a minute. I recognize your armor. You're one of the Myrmidons, am I right? I always dreamed of crossing swords with one of you, and finding out whether what they say about you is true. I have no time for that, and I have no quarrel with you. I kindly ask you to let me go. Did I hear you right? You think I'm a weakling? Or maybe you're just a coward? Draw your weapon and face me! Right here and now! It seems like you leave me no choice. No warrior has managed to defeat me yet. I hope you won't disappoint me. That weapon like a child. What did you just say? You heard me right. Like a child. I'll tear you apart for that, you bastard. <laughs> was a worthy fight. Please forgive me for doubting your abilities. Tell me, why did you spare me? I also used to think that I was invincible. However, there was one who proved me wrong. You've got the strength of a dozen men. Do not waste it on feeding your own humans. Instead, is it to help others? I will do just that. <sighs> Thank you, great warrior. I will not forget this lesson. It's been a while since... I don't seek trouble. I'm just cutting down this tree.
have mercy. Tuck your tail and run. But let me live. You bloody! Get me that son of a bitch!
See a shrine. terrain. I guess I'm headed in the right direction. mentioned past three here? His armor must be worth a fortune. <laughs> that the kidnappers left behind quite the bloody trail. See a shrine.
the smith must be close. But when I finally meet him, what shall I say? Fortunately, I don't have to roll some kind of boulder up this hill. So, you're the one who's been slaughtering me men like pigs. Tell me what you want, or you'll get an arrow between your eyes. Supposedly, you and your band hold a smith prisoner here. Is that right? That's none of your business, you stray. Besides, he came here in vain. The guy busted himself out, went inside the mountain, and that's the last we saw of him. In that case, I'll go look for him. Get out of my way, and you shall leave to see another day. You've got balls, I'll give you that. But you're not getting something. There's only one of you, and a whole band of us. Besides, the armor you're wearing looks interesting. Menelaus will pay handsomely for it. And usually I don't like opportunities to pass me by. Kill him! Kill the bastard! You should never come here. to the inside of the mountain. They must be opened by some kind of liver. should be open now. This must be some kind of abandoned stronghold. A very old stronghold. This monument is 
just move it. Fear will consume you! During battle, these narrow passages would have been great for defense. Even my no sign of the smith. Maybe he just... I have to keep the
of this tunnel. Just another glory and loot seeking brawler. Grease has enough of them already. How am I supposed to prove that? Hmm. In an old temple, not far from here, people have been disappearing. I don't know if they've been kidnapped by some bandits, or if there is a beast lurking in there. I want you to solve that problem. I am not your errand boy. And it isn't my duty to help you until I see that you do something for the common folk. <sighs> I'll check that place out. Stay behind. And don't let yourself get captured again. <laughs> don't worry about me. I'll make my way to this smithy shortly. We will see each other there once you're done. Oh, one more thing. When you return, use the shortcut at the end of the pass. Just don't forget to throw the ladder down. The elves who dragged me here said they use it a lot. No time to waste. Go to the temple and take care of whatever you find in there. We will see each other in the smithy. Huh! <laughs> 
Another venture ahead of me, and I have even more questions and fewer answers. The dead rising from their graves, monsters known only from legends out of the roads. Soldiers under a man whom I trusted want to kill me, and these damned apparitions. It felt like they were looking for me.
Well, well, well. What do we have here? It's been a while since I've seen a shrine. Nice birdie. Come here, man. I feel a piercing cold in this place.
this must be the missing people that Smith mentioned. I'm glad you agreed to take care of this matter. I'm certain you'll handle it. Each of your men is worth five of Menelaus' soldiers. Take the armor I managed to rustle up. You have to arrange weapons yourselves. Somewhere in those ruins, the bandits must have their hideout. Kill them all, with no exception. Now I'm giving you an advance. You'll get the other half when you finish the job. Maybe I should find out more about this. deadly strike reached me. I began to plunge into the abyss. I thought I was falling, but I was actually drowning. Drowning surrounded by the cavernous darkness of the water's depths. And even though my lungs were filled with water and my body was overcome by the cold, I did not die. That was quite useful. It's you. We talked at the cemetery. I didn't expect to see you here. Someone has to take care of these places. Abandoned, full of memories and pain. Times have changed and death, like life, is worth little more than a handful of ashes. You look quite pale. Are you all right? No, not entirely. Lately, I've been seeing some apparitions. They look like they don't belong in this world. Where did they come from? The apparitions you encounter on your journey are suspended between the kingdoms of the living and of the dead. They must be finding their way here in places where the line between the worlds is thinnest. Why are they haunting me? They're looking for souls who avoided judgment and returned to the world of the living. Souls? Does that mean I'm... That? that would explain why you lost your memory, and you can see things others can't. Not only do I see them, but I can feel more than before. The shrines you mentioned are drawing me toward them, as if I became a part of them. They connect the world of the living and the underworld. It seems that your soul got split between these two kingdoms, and that's why it is drawn to the shrines. I don't understand. If I'm dead, why would I return to the living? It seems you've been given another chance. 
And there is something important ahead for you to do. I have a piece of advice for you. Try to focus on your goal. That will help you in times of doubt. Visible force is blocking this entrance. I need to focus and spot it. came here faster than I expected. Did you manage to put the temple in order? I got rid of a raid hunting that place. Now it's time for you to answer my questions. Did you see warriors wearing armor similar to mine anywhere? I was their commander. Really? You lost your own unit. <laughs> I admit you're a good leader. Woke up with the gap in my memory. Ten years after the war broke out. I don't know what I'm doing here, where my men are, and why some fucking voice ordered me to find you. You must think I'm mad, and I don't blame you. I myself no longer believe my own thoughts. Eh, truth be told, I heard more convincing stories in roadside inns, but I believe you. <sighs> After the war ended, people said that Menelaus was supposed to take leadership of the Myrmidons. I would talk to him if I were you. Where will I find him? Ah, not so fast. As far as I know, he closed his residence shut. Not even a mouse can sneak in. Besides, there are still people around here who need help. And only one of us is a warrior. What am I supposed to do now? <sighs> Lysander, a hunter who brings me hides regularly, is late with his delivery. I hope he's not in some kind of trouble. I'll check on him. And meanwhile, I concoct a way for you to get into Menelaus' residence.
another favor. I'm not his errand boy. On the other hand, what choice do I have? Since when they must kill the bastard! He must know where they are and why they became targets of his henchmen. That's everything this... What's his name? Lysander had on him. Just some useless junk. Wave the blade in front of him, and he'll squeal where he keeps something more valuable. Or, at least show us where he hid his daughter. Hey, someone has sneaked in here. You blind? Look at his armor. It's one of those... What are they called? Myrmidons. Myrmidons. That's what I said. The both of us can cut him up no problem. Maybe the soldiers will even give us a prize. You're right. Let's get him. Get the horse, son. <laughs> to pay tribute to me? The Lord of the Roads? Why are you gaping as if you were tongue-tied? Want to end up like this hunter? I don't see no Lord here. At most, just a coward, magging defenseless fall. Release this man. You scum! I'll order my people to tie you up to a tree and skin you alive. You mean those thugs guarding the camp entry? I already took care of them. You did what? Do you know how difficult it is to find a qualified thug nowadays? I see two ways forward. Release Lysander and I'll forget I ever met you. Or you'll join your comrades. The choice is yours. Ever since Menelaus closed Mycenae off on the order of that crowned fool, poverty has been rampant everywhere. Everyone is doing what they can to survive. That doesn't give you the right to prey on others. Release that poor man while I still have some patience left. You can't tell me what to do, you mutt! You should never come here. Huh. 
will be safer without you. You're safe now. The smith sent me. My daughter. She ran away from the bandits. Please, you have to help her. Calm down and tell me exactly what happened. Like every year before the festival, I went hunting for game in honor of our goddess. Cloyote insisted on joining me. We went into the woods, and the bandits assaulted us. I shouted for her to run, and then I lost sight of her. These woods are full of vicious beasts. Please, oh noble warrior, find her. I'll give you everything I own. Stay here. I'll bring your daughter back. Not far from here, I saw signs of a wolf feeding. That's where we separated. Perhaps that's where you should begin your search. These traces of blood are barely visible. Maybe my seeing gifts will help me see more. Oh, my God. 
other side of the pass. I have to think of a way to get there. Coyote? Hold on. I'll get you out of there. No. Don't come closer. She... she's still here. Lurking in the dark. A shield in the woods brought you to this world. And I'll take you out. Come here. Closer.
make things easier. See a shrine.
where is... Where's my daughter? Where's Cryote? She's dead. Dead? I... I don't believe you. I've reached the lair of a she-wolf. I killed the beast, but Cryote's wounds were too severe. There was nothing more I could do. Tell me... Did she suffer? She passed away peacefully. She said that it wasn't your fault. And that she loved you. You took her away, goddess of the hunt. The most precious thing in my life. Why did you take her and not me? I don't know what it's like to lose a daughter, but... I once lost my entire unit. Those were the best men a commander could wish for. The only thing keeping me alive is the goal. A new goal. I turned grief into strength that leads me. Tell me, what kind of a goal could the father of a deceased daughter fight? Something terribly wrong is happening in this realm. Help people. Lend them your abilities and your grief. It will lighten with time. Take these hides. Sell them. Use them. Do whatever you want with them. I don't want to look at them. I got these dumb hides. But at what price? Time to get back to the smith. These are the heights from Lysander. <laughs> Good job. They're fresh and ready for trimming. Uh, why do you seem so down? During the hunt, Lysander and Cleote were ambushed by bandits. I managed to save him, but his daughter is dead. Fell victim to the wolves. I had a feeling I could save her. Lysander knew the risks of taking a child hunting, but he still made that decision. If that little birdie was hunted down by the pack, her chances were really slim. You did well. You did what you could, lad. You have to understand that you won't be able to save everyone, especially when people don't exercise due caution. Speaking of caution, Firtos was muttering about some troubles. <laughs> he's a pick of the lad. I should have left him in that damn army if he's so eager to get into trouble. Help him! And meanwhile, I'll tan these hides and start preparing a... Well, you'll see for yourself. I heard that you got yourself into some trouble again. The Master sent me to search for a very durable raw material. I asked around and a certain former friend told me I can find it in the ruins near Mycenae. No sooner had I gone inside than a scorpion jumped on me. A huge, ugly one. I barely made it out alive. Do you always have to wander around ruins and wake huge scorpions up? <sighs> Where will I find it? In a rocky canyon near the fishing spot. Surely you'll find it. 
When you take care of him, bring me a few pieces of its armor. They may come in handy for Master's new project. Get the horse, son! Take what you want, but let me leave! energy here. See a shrine. Surrender or die. Don't kill me! Someone's looking for trouble. I can rest by it. 
Surrender or die! Stop at this gate. I should check this ruins out. Oh, 
has been here for a long time. Scorpion must be somewhere here. city must have hidden deep down. Thank <laughs> you. 
Bossan! The scorpion is no more. Thanks. You saved my life for the second time already. If that monstrosity wandered off here, I don't even want to think about what it would do to me. I see you managed to get armor pieces from that monster. Take them to my master. He'll know what to do with them. You'll find him in our new workshop, not far from here. I almost forgot. Take these few trinkets as a token of my gratitude. I'm sure they will be of more use to you than me.
Set. See, you've made yourself quite comfortable here. <sighs> that old hellhole was no longer good for anything. These are Scarpian armor pieces, and not just any. They'll be useful for the plan I concocted. Plainly speaking, you'll go to Menelaus' residence in disguise. <sighs> disguise? Perhaps I shall dress up as a horse as well. <laughs> That's not such a stupid plan. But I have a better one. Menelaus is looking for a new henchman for his crew. But he won't admit to anyone. Especially not someone flaunting Myrmidon armor. I'll make you armor that will evoke awe and respect among his soldier boys. I'm certain you will get inside easily with it. It will take me a moment, but I promise you that the result will be worthwhile. Well, come on. Try it on. Tough as Cyclops skin. Huh. Fits me perfectly. Why did you choose a scorpion for the symbol? That was Furta's idea. I think he just wanted to return the favor. Besides, he couldn't have chosen anything better. You're just as stubborn as those beasts. You can bite fiercely, and you never give up. Thank you. That is truly a unique gift. I must now head forth. When you stand before Menelaus, remember that he's no more than the raging dog on Agamemnon's leash. It was the king's decisions that drowned Greece in blood. I will make Menelaus sing, and his brother will suffer the same fate. Good luck, boy. I hope you know what you're getting yourself into.
see. Got him. Take him. I need your help. A girl. I should check what this is about. Well, well, well. Who do we have here? Don't come any closer. Haven't you heard the passage is closed? By the way, how did you get past that warrior on the bridge? I saw him chopping off a Cyclops' head with just one cut. He fought bravely and wore impressive armor. But still, he couldn't defeat me. I heard that Menelaus is looking for a new man for his army. I wanted to volunteer. The commander did open up admissions to his army again. You can pass, but be quick about it before those living dead return. And remember, when you stand before Menelaus, show him due respect.
It's been a while since I've seen a shrine. What do you mean you don't know where he is? I searched the entire village, but there was no sign of him, my lord. Am I to understand that a fucking ghost is slaughtering my people? Go on with your search. I want him dead or alive. And one more thing. When you report to the king, remember about the passage papers. I see you. No one can get into my CD without them. Yes, my lord. Your armor is impressive. But where do you come, warrior? I was fighting in Troy. I appreciate soldiers with war experience. Maybe I can find a spot for you among my ranks. What brings you here? I'm looking for Myrmidons. So are we. I heard that one of those cuts is still breathing and murdering my people with impunity. If you get that dog, I'll reward you handsomely. What happened to the rest of them? They met the fate of traitors, and were replaced by men loyal and devoted to the king. Since you served in Troy, you should have known that. Who are you, anyway? I used to be the commander of a unit. I led the greatest warriors that Greece has ever seen. I remember the day I led them to Troy's walls, defeated Hector, and I was supposed to rescue your wife. But none of that matters now. Achilles? That's... impossible! You were dead! Dead! You're the one murdering my men. Now that I know what you did, it's time for you to pay for your crimes! Guards! Guards! Stop him! Kill him! You heard the commander's orders. Take him! I should have expected this. Get him! than I thought.
don't understand. That vicious band of yours stood in the way of peace. They didn't listen to anyone but you. Look around, you fool. Wherever I look, all I see is murder and looting. Is that what you call peace? These are necessary sacrifices. And when all enemies are dead, a new order will finally reign in Greece. I used to know Menelaus, who was no stranger to honor. Since Agamemnon has been pouring poison into your ears, you've become a blind servant of his will. A power-hungry monster. Maybe even Helen was nothing more than an excuse to start this hopeless war. Helen? So that's why you are here. She's mine. She will be mine forever. And you'll die like that Trojan mongrel for whom she wanted to betray me. I will gut you and throw you to the crows to feast on. I burned alive! <laughs> Why? Won't you die? Your commander, may your souls rest in peace. One of the soldiers mentioned something about passage papers and a seal. I need to get them if I want to see Agamemnon. This looks like the private quarter. Is this possible? Helen, you were the first victim of that sick bastard that was trying to save you from Paris, instead of protecting you from your own husband. And even after your death, that brute didn't let you go. Those must be the papers Mr. Mayers mentioned. I won't find anything else in here. Maybe there is a secret passageway here somewhere. Helen. You were the first victim of that sick monster. Helen. You were the first victim of that sick monster. The 
this needs to open something. Seal. I have everything I need to get to my city.
Time to see the one proclaiming himself the King of Greece. I need your help. A girl? I should check what this is about. Surrender or die! Oh! <laughs> 
Get the horse side! <laughs> What is this monstrosity? Surrender to his will, and he shall show you mercy. Like he did to me. I would rather not, if you could grant me this mercy. <laughs> I can see a shrine. Kill the bastard! <laughs> <laughs> Oh! <laughs> 
something tangible here. I'll get you bloody! The silent Colossi still stands guard. A reminder of Carissa's last glory. Surrender or die! Don't even think that I'm gonna let you in. Shove off before I lose my patience. I have a message from Menelaus. The papers and the seal look genuine. You have quite decent armor. Are they giving out ones like that now? You can enter. My head. Again, this weird... memory. I remember that I felt someone's presence in the abyss. These beings were circling me with curiosity, observing me, but not attacking. What did they want from me? They were dancing around me, whispering their songs, as if I were one of them. A drunk or a maniac? What? What did you say? You heard me. As soon as you walked in, you fell and lay on the ground for quite a while. I think you're up to something. Guards! And it was such a smooth sailing. An intruder! Stop him! My Cine. Since my last visit, it's Get gotten worse here.
cares for Greece as much as for the city. Get him! No wonder he's tempted into things. <laughs> Knowing that old clown, he doesn't whine, frolicking with orders. my life, I've welcomed the rulers of the world within these walls. I didn't think I would live to see the day when the ghosts of the past would start haunting me. You won't escape the past, no matter how much you wish to. So, the Oracle was right. She said you'd come back, that you come to take the crown from me. To have your name written in gold on the pages of history books. I came to stop the suffering you brought on Greece. Suffering? <laughs> I ended the war, raised Troy to the ground, and Greece became the largest power in history. Greece is drowning in blood! But how would you know? You sealed off the city, only not to see the truth. The truth that you failed as a king and defender of these lands. But even the high walls you built to separate yourself from the world couldn't stop the consequences of your own undoing. And they've come to demand their prize. Soldiers! Surround him! Kill him! Ah, he flees as cowardly as his brother. <laughs> Mercy.
think I can see a shrine. Those soldiers don't fight for him out of loyalty, but out Kill of the battle. lives lavishly while his people are dying soon he shall pay for everything your reign is coming to an end right here right now you think killing me is going to change anything I won't bring back the lives lost to a tyranny but I can ensure that no one else dies on your orders. <laughs> Thanks to the decisions and sacrifices I made, Greece expanded its borders like never before. And I, at its forefront, faced with the same choices, I would have made them without any hesitation. You really don't feel any remorse for what you did. You're a mad monster, wearing a crown. You're a naive child. Haven't you learned that the world is ruled by power and fear? Power and fear. They're eternal, like a name engraved on a rock. They made me the most powerful man in Greece. And you, you're just a tale from the past. Barely remembered by any. Come on, you dog. Challenge the king of kings himself. Reach for the eternal glory or perish forgotten. You thought you forgot how to fight? Maybe you do remember. But pray that you can keep up with me. Oh, look. I had ten years to prepare for this encounter. You'll see. <laughs> Defeat me. The king of kings lives forever! <laughs> <laughs> 
Humanity has already been dead for years. By killing you, I would just be doing a favor to this tormented land. Alaka, what the hell is this? The one who sowed fear throughout Greece now dies in terror. He is still hesitating. So weak. I will help him. The one who sowed fear throughout Greece has died in terror. Impressive how much fear you yourself can instill. Even though your time in this world should have long ended. Soon we shall meet again, Achilles. <laughs> So indeed, he's here. You again? Are you following me? How did you get here? That's not relevant right now. Have you also seen that symbol? Yes, I have. I also heard someone's voice. What the hell was that? And why did it appear over his body? That's a mark of fear and oppression. Something, or rather someone, has just manifested their presence in this world but his servants have been working for a long time. In the old ruins, beyond the pass, kidnappers imprisoned a group of priests. Among them is someone who could prove to be a valuable ally in the fight against the new threat. If you don't manage to free them, the consequences could be irreversible. Getting there will take me... Who are you? I'll tell you everything in due time, but we don't have much of it now. Go through the portal and free the priests. Every minute counts. Those men in black robes, they kidnapped me and my companions. They're still holding them captive there. You've got to help them. I'll go look for them, and you should find a safe shelter. Watch your step. That monster, it's still there. Monster? It was slithering through these corridors like a snake. By all that is holy, beware, a oh warrior, beware! It's been a while since I've seen a shrine.
the whore, son! Please, find the other priests. They're in grave danger.
Drag me to it. I'm not one of the kidnappers. I came here to free you. Run away as fast as you can. Oh, thank the gods. The rest of my companions are still somewhere here. Please, find them. The fear will consume you!
The symbols must be the key to opening that chest.
that lever. Alright. Now I can move that lever. I'll cleanse myself with your blood! <laughs> yourself. and scratches, but I'm alive, thanks to you. Is it? It disappeared. At least for now. Come on. We have to go through this portal. It's not safe here. Very well, then. I'll go first, but you have to go right behind me.
How good it is to breathe fresh air again. Thank you, Achilles. I owe you my life and the lives of others. How do you know my name? I know more about you than you think. My name is Pythia. I served people as an oracle for years. These hooded people. They were the ones who kidnapped us and brought us to these cursed ruins. A long time ago, I saw that being in my vision. How it grows and emerges from an evil warped heart. Do these visions always have to be so mysterious? What else did you see? Alas, that's everything I remember. The vision was brief and vague. To better understand the nature of that being, I'll have to retrieve knowledge from my old temple. If you want to help me with that, let's meet up by the old gate near Mycenae. It leads to the other side of the mountains. And if you know anyone from around here, you should warn them. Dark times are coming. I will do just that. I'll join you soon. Take care. Just you. I'm not in the right headspace for a chat. I can see that something's bothering you. Where's Firtos? Firtos left. Besides, it's none of your business. Tell me what you want. I wanted to warn you. After Agamemnon's death, a certain being appeared. It's not from this world. It kidnaps priests, and some followers serve it. Malaka! I could feel it in my bones that your visit to Mycenae could bring trouble. I'm starting to regret helping you. If it's as bad as you say, I'll have to warn the people around. What are you planning to do now? I need to help the Oracle. We're trying to find out more about this being. What it is, or who, and its plans. Seems that one problem caused another. Shit. What did you get yourself into this time?
that hooded man knew a suspicious amount about the priests and that being. I hope I will encounter him again. Must be the key to opening that chest.
closed shut. I want to open the gate from this side. Maybe I can find some other passage. Good to see you, Achilles. It seems that the old gate is closed. But I managed to find this cave. The entrance to it is blocked by this symbol. I've seen it before. It's some kind of seal. It beams with a powerful, unknown force. I'll try to destroy it. Wait. This problem can't be solved with muscles. Maybe I'll try taking care of it. Ori Sindiastir. Ta Ori Stay. Ori Sindiastir. Ta Ori Stay. One more time. Focus. Ori Sindiastir. Ta Ori Stay. Huh. I didn't fully believe it would work. Well, it seems that the passage is open. Let's go inside. Wait. It's too risky for you to go with me. If for some reason that creature wants to hunt you down, it's best not to make it easy for it. Its minions might have intentionally blocked the main gate and set a trap for us in this cave. In that case, you go first and look for a way to open the gate. If I remember correctly, there were some levers on the other side. Why did you hide your true nature from me? Many signs suggest that fear plays a crucial role in current events. That's why you saw me in inhuman form. The process that has started can still be stopped. But 
to accomplish this, we'll have to trust each other, Hercules. I now have to leave to try and delay the decay of my kingdom. Stay close to your allies. Their help will prove invaluable in the times to come. Wait. I don't understand any of this. Now I remember everything. Just when I thought I would spend eternity in the realm of the dead, he appeared. I took his hand, and he pulled me from the deepest depths. Out of all people, he chose me, a mere mortal. I was supposed to set out for a new war, the most important war of my life. My courage combined with the power of Styx was supposed to be the weapon that would give us a chance of winning, and that would save both worlds from the impending doom. Ryan. Kill the bastard! What are you doing here? I realized I couldn't leave you alone with all this mess. From what the Oracle managed to tell me, the situation looks serious. I can already sense a foreign aura that is weakening me here. I'm afraid the minions of that being have reached these parts. They may have taken over my temple. Make sure it's safe there, Achilles. You will find it near the mountain range. If that being's force corrupted my temple, you'll have to find a way to clear it of its influence. Before you go, I also would like to ask you for a favor. I need to retrieve a certain... old hammer infused with great power. Uh, to take on something outside the world of the living. 
You'll need much better equipment. I can't make any with the crap I have on hand. The hammer is somewhere in the labyrinth, erected on a certain island. Sounds like a fairy tale. But I've trusted you so far. And I'll trust you now too. How do I get there? Reach the harbor and embark on a ship. And sail straight ahead east. Surely you'll find it. I'll look around for that hammer and check the temple. You too should stay behind. Good luck, Achilles. Hopefully, our joint effort can save Greece. That hammer... Armor must be worth a fortune. See a shrine. Kill the bastard! <laughs> Oh! <laughs> 
here. Malaka, the Spectres again. I've defeated the likes of you before, so I can defeat you too.
better at this. Thank you, Achilles. You've freed the place I've been bound to for years, even though a lot has changed here. The temple was haunted by two specters, but I expelled them. I also found some mosques with frightening countenances. The temple was erected in a place where the line between the worlds is very thin. They may have accumulated the energy of these specters, corrupting the place. I don't care about the masks. The most important thing is that you got rid of those ghosts. And I have a place where I can make your equipment. Of course. Once you bring me that hammer I told you about. Help the blacksmith, Achilles. Meanwhile, I'll recite my prayers to unite with the power of this place.
should be open. Kill the bastard. See a shrine. You look like a great warrior, stranger. I can see it in your eyes, the scars adorning your body. You were in the army, were you not? Many years ago, during the Trojan War. But that's an old tale. So, you were in luck, having experienced the soldier's life, the life of honor. I've lost my friend. Tell me your story. First, I disappointed my brother. Then, my commander. I couldn't save them from the downfall, even though I had the chance. If I hadn't joined Tidy's band, everything would have turned out differently. The ideas? The son of a bitch who took care of this part of Greece. But in reality, he's nothing more than a murderer. He deserves to die in agony for the crimes he committed. I know that my remorseful words aren't enough. So I'd like to die by the hand of someone like you. 
It's the only way for me to cleanse the stain on my name. Will you give me a death worthy of a warrior? If that is your wish, get ready to fight. I don't wish for anything else. With honor, so I gave you an honorable death. I hope you found your peace.
This ship will do. I can get to the eye. All right. If I hadn't sailed on similar ships in the past, I'm sure I would have crashed on those dumb rocks. Not a soul inside. What in the name of the gods? Someone tried to hide behind these doors. Kill the bastard! Money, boss. I can see a shrine. I need to find a way to open. Place looks ancient. I wonder how the Smith found out about it. Oh, another closed passage. I have to open it somehow. <laughs>
where this path leads.
buses should be open now. Closed shut. I need to open it somehow. in the right direction.
wonder what else the smith failed to mention about this place. <laughs>
I have a bad feeling about this. I better prepare. was supposed to be just an easy favor for the smith. That hammer has to be somewhere in here. Found it. It seems to be pulsating with living fire. How did the smith find that hammer? The ship is right where I left it. Excellent. Time.
Get me that son of a bitch! I can see a shrine. Managed to retrieve the hammer you told me about. <laughs> well done. I was beginning to doubt whether I hadn't sent you perhaps in vain. Did everything go smoothly? Besides sharp as knife rocks, the undead, metal statues, and a half man, half bull, it was a piece of cake. <sighs> I didn't want to torment you with unnecessary details. Anyway, you did a hell of a good job. Harnessing its power is gonna take me some time. Oh, by the way, the Oracle wanted to speak with you. Thank you, Achilles. You've freed the place I've been bound to for years, even though a lot has changed here. The temple was haunted by two specters, but I expelled them. I also found some mosques with frightening countenances. The temple was erected in a place where the line between the worlds is very thin. They may have accumulated the energy of these specters, corrupting the place. I don't care about the masks! The most important thing is that you got rid of those ghosts. And I have a place where I can make your equipment. Achilles, I'm going to need another thing from you. I need an item infused with that being's power to maintain the integrity of my vision. I remember that one of the kidnappers was wearing a ring with that cursed symbol. I believe it will help us better understand what we're fighting against. Can you tell me more about the kidnapper? It was a bold man with a scar and black paint on his face. He frightened those hooded fanatics, so I assume he was their leader. Go look for him in the harbor. There is no shortage of bandits and troublemakers there. Maybe you'll come across his trail. I will return once I find out something about him.
shrine. your tail and run! What do we have here? Another lost lamb? I'll find a place for you too. Release these people, and I'll let you go and think about your life. <laughs> their, their time has it come. <laughs> he who is marked is waiting for the Lord's orders. When he receives them, they will play their part. And then everything will begin. That's enough of this nonsense. Kill the bastard! <laughs> <laughs> Kill! 
kill the bastard. <laughs> I don't know how to thank you, stranger. There are some symbols on this chest. Maybe I can open it if I find them all. What were these monks? They thought we were priests. When they were- Do you- Go along- Hide- to the underground near the square. See him, boys? I need to get there. This must be the place that woman mentioned. Kill the boss! <laughs> that returned. 
I've heard of you, Achilles. My lord has foreseen that you'd soon pay me a visit. Know that he will surely appreciate your voluntary sacrifice. Why are you keeping... Take away my glory! My glory! I didn't come here for glory. I came here to punish you for your crimes. <laughs> you bold fool! You'll be begging for mercy! Citizens will be relieved when they learn of your death. Gods, I thought this was the end.
Take him! <laughs> This is the ring. Its owner was the right-hand man of the being we're looking for. It beams with a powerful force. The same one I felt at the sealed doors. I hope it can help direct my vision. The line between the world of the living and the dead is very thin here. I don't know how powerful my vision will be, or what consequences it will bring. Remember everything you're about to hear, and don't get scared. Voy triste más, que esto no cae. Dos semanas de Sofía Sas. Voy triste más, que esto no cae.
Santa.
Get the horse on! Come on, then.
for trouble. I'm looking for an expert hunter. Do you know someone like that here? If he was in the last group of refugees, he should be in the village near the swamps. But I'm afraid you're too late. How come? People say that a great beast attacked the village. A few defenders faced it, but didn't stand the slightest chance against it. If he managed to survive, it must have been some miracle. I need to try and find him. Thanks for the information. Take care. If you believe the rumors, that beast is a true monstrosity. Have I need to mercy. get to the village. Just be that son of a bitch! Ryan. Malaka. The traces suggest something huge ran through here. I need to assess the situation and find the hunter. Lysander? What are you doing here? After Cleothe's death, I wanted to take my own life. But I met this family. They wouldn't be able to survive in the wilderness on their own for long, so I helped them. When we saw that the old gate near Mycenae was open, we went to the harbor and then to this village. However, the war has reached us here, too. By the way, what are you doing here? I need to hunt down a beast whose claws are tougher than iron. Supposedly, it's prowling the area. I saw it running through the locals and charging through the village. These madmen in black robes must have started it. Until now, I thought these creatures existed only in fairy tales. But my eyes did not lie. It was a chimera. Check if anyone in the village managed to survive and bring these people to me. Meanwhile, I'll prepare something that will help you hunt this monster down. A shrine, at last.
You understand? They'll get what they deserve. Find shelter. It's not safe. Thank you, sir. I'll do exactly that. An infidel! Kill him!
the bastard! <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
Thank you, good sir. Gods themselves must have sent you here. I won't ever forget that. I won't find any more survivors. Time to return to Lysander. That's everyone I managed to find. I'm afraid the rest are dead. You did what you could. These people and I, we won't forget your sacrifice. People said that the Chimera tried to hide in a cave in, not far from here. You'll need bait to lure it out. Take this bundle. It's fresh lamb coated in pork fat. An aroma like that will surely lure that beast out of the deepest of depths. Thanks for the help. 
Try to get to the harbor and flee on the ship going as far away from here as possible. It should be a bit safer there. All right, we'll do that. Thank you for everything, Achilles. Once again, thank you for everything you did, Achilles. May luck never leave your sight.
get out of here. Time to close more rifts.
symbols on this chest. Maybe I can open it if I find them all. This time, he'll have the courage to face me. Don't let your stubbornness blind your sound mind. Armor your wary can resist the corrupting power of Phobos. But you yourself have to be extremely careful, Achilles. The enemy will try to enslave you by using various methods. He wants to make a chosen one out of you that will lead his agents to war. Oh, <laughs> 
be a fool to challenge me and my own kingdom. But you're not one to give up, Achilles. Even if you know that you're going straight into the mouth of fear. <laughs> Until I tear apart your flesh, you monster, my story continues on. <laughs> You're calling me a monster? But have you ever seen me kill anyone? You, on the other hand, know only how to kill. Just think about how many sons you've taken from their mothers. How many brothers and sisters you orphaned. You were so focused on getting me, that you didn't take a look at your own reflection. You're a worm preying on other spheres, but your short life is coming to an end now. You threatened me with death under my own roof. Soon you'll know a fate worse than death. I can promise you that.
I can just have to work out the out of it. Supposedly, hope springs eternal, when it seemed that Phobos would prevail and forever enshroud Greece in a veil of fear. Against him stood he, the bravest of Myrmidons, Achilles. He made peace with the past and accepted his weaknesses. After all, he was only human. With cold iron in hand and the flame of courage in his heart, he descended into Phobos' lair and defeated him. But was it for good? Agamemnon was right about one thing. Fear is eternal. 
It will always find a way to crawl into our hearts and poison them with doubt. Make our goals unattainable and our fights doomed to fail. Achilles managed to tame his weaknesses. Despite doubt, he found the strength to act. He was supported by his new friends at each stage of his journey. The trust and help of his companions tipped the scales. Greece was saved and the wounds covering it will heal over time. There was only one matter left. The world of the living was no longer a place for Achilles. Hades, the Lord of the Dead, will come back for him once he repairs the damage done to his kingdom. Achilles accepted his destiny. However, his legend will inspire future generations. <laughs>